In today's video, we're gonna talk about this newly created Blender add-on called Real Cloud. The add-on basically helps you create cool-looking clouds or add existing VDB clouds from its library. Also, it has numerous cool features that allow you to manipulate the clouds in a unique way. The first feature that we're gonna discuss is called Convert to Clouds. This one lets you make a cloud out of any object that you want meaning that you can make any object look like a cloud. This is actually an amazing feature, which I don't think exists in any similar add-ons, as far as I know. It will help you make some cute scenes, especially if you want to create anime-related scenes or stylized ones. It also works nicely and it converts the mesh in just a short period of time. What's great about the add-on is it gives you optimized real cloud shaders that allow for fast rendering performance which will help you massively when dealing with a lot of clouds. Additionally, the add-on gives access to a huge library of clouds that contain over 200 VDB clouds with a lot of variety. So you can easily add these assets and you can easily select the one that you like and drop it right into the 3D viewport. The add-on is super easy to use. Also, you can find all the settings it has in its control panel in the end panel of your 3D viewport. You can also control the color of the clouds, the density and its scattering, and many, many other stuff. In addition, you can adjust some parameters such as seed, size, detail, display percentage, as well as the remesh resolution. Also, there is a magical button in the control panel called Cycles Auto Setup. And once you click it, it will automatically execute basic cycles rendering settings, which is really, really good. Generally speaking, Real Cloud is a really good add-on because it has high-quality shaders that are optimized for fast rendering and it has a large asset library of VDBs and using it, you can convert any mesh into a cloud which can be used in different scenes and different settings. So if you are interested, you will find the necessary links in the description. I hope you guys found this video useful and informative. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Also subscribe to this channel to stay updated with videos like this. Thank you guys very much for watching again and I'll see you in the next one.